just got home and all the power is out. We got a blackout going on. Nothing is working. Everything is out. Guys, I'm PT Van Life, right? I'm PT Van Life, and I have a van. And my van has power supplies. Wow. I got a thousand watt, 1,036 watt, 2,000 surge power station. And I've also got a DIY. 1500 watt DIY power station. Unfortunately, I only have a 500 watt uh, inverter, but it can power small appliances for a longer period of time. Wow, so welcome back to the channel. Let's see what happens. And by the way, the van is back together. Let's go check it out. So over here, I have my DIY 1500 watt power station. Inside, I have two 750 watt uh, lead acid batteries, yes, I know. But also 500 watt inverter, everything's in the box. I don't want to move all this stuff. And you can plug up to a few devices. This is cable, uh, solar powered ready. I have a four 25 watt solar power panels add up to a hundred. And right here, guys, it's giving us the light on the situation. This is my Alphys ESS 1036 watt power station. We're ready. Yeah, we're ready if this persists just a little while. We should be okay tonight, okay? I'm downstairs in the Black Pearl. She's all put back together. Let me let you guys see what she looks like. Mr. Softy showed up. I guess everybody outside. Oh, guys, here she is. She's put back together. Black pearl. So, she's back together, y'all. <laughs> she's back together. That's right. I bought this downstairs, plug it in the van, and charge it up because she was holding what, 80? She's at uh, 82 now. So, charge that guy on up. <clears throat> Don't know what's going to happen for the rest of the night. I'm already called ball, cost, call boss lady, let her know. Ain't no power in the house. What you gonna do? <laughs> what you gonna do? You go to your home away from home where there is some power. That's what you do. Now, guys, listen. I don't. I think I done mentioned that twice before in a video. See, one of the side perks about van life, uh, you full-time full -time guys, y'all handle your own business. Some of us part-time guys, right, and, and ladies. So we got vans, we got power stations, we got all this stuff. We could find ourselves at home, sticks and bricks, and the power goes out. You know, stuff happens. Bad weather, knock the lines down, you don't pay your bill. You know, all that kind of stuff can happen, right? And guess what? You don't have to panic because if you have enough power, right, you have enough power uh, in reserve, for emergency and food and water and flashlights. That's right. And all of that kind of stuff. All that okay. food, water, flashlights, uh, extra phone, all those emergency, emergency things, guys. We got to be prepared. We got to be prepared. We got to be prepared. Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Welcome back, PT Van Life. Guys, it feels so good to be back in my van with her. The way she is all set up right now, it's getting a little too hot in here, though. I'm going to have to turn this off. I'm going to let it run for a while and power this station all the rest of the way up. So I'm going to be sitting here. If there is no power in the house, that means you can't light the stove. If you can't light the stove in the house, 
can't cook in the house. You can't cook in the house. You might have to cook in your van. You know what I'm saying? So we'll see how it goes, right? Yeah, we'll see how it goes when I come back. I'm learning how to do a little part of a video and then wait a little while and continue. So this is your wait a little while and continue. Hold on. I'll be right back. And when you know it, just like that, the lights will come back on. But nevertheless, we were prepared. So today's going to be, we're going to make two grass-fed super cheeseburgers. Guys, I got some sauces I want to introduce you to. I picked these up from Aldi's. There's a honey mustard. Spicy brown, everybody's familiar with. A Dijon mustard. And what we're going to be trying today with the burgers is this. Chipotle Aldi spread made for burgers. We're going to see what happened with that. So I need to go ahead on and get all this stuff all chopped up and uh, ready to go. So I have a mixed green salad on the side, so, and some potato salad. How about that, huh? Have a pretty decent meal today. Both prefer the ranch. Yeah, so while the food is cooking, guys, <laughs> I'm like, I'm glad for YouTube channels like um, Lead Farmer 77 down here in South Carolina. You know, he, te he teaches a lot on his channel, guys, about being uh, ready in case of a catastrophe, natural emergency. He teaches about camping out, about all the supplies you need, you know, how to start fires, how to do a whole bunch of different stuff. So I'm new to the game, so I'm glad content creators like him, you know, um, yeah, help teach us how to do some things, so, you know, in the event, you never know, like I said, the power might go out, it might be a couple hours, might be a few days, 
who knows, but you always got to be ready. These have these have the, the seven day supply of something saved up. Money ain't going to do you no good whatsoever. We're talking about stuff, food, your, your essentials, food, water, you know, stuff like that. So there we go. We got them crowns ready. I went ahead on and toasted them puppies. There they go. And get ready for these burgers to come out. I'm going to have some potato salad on the side. She's just going to have a salad. So. And these are supposed to be high-end burgers. So we'll see. I'm using a cast iron skittle, skittle because uh, it cooks better. It cooks better. I don't like it what it do to bacon, but you may kind of tear bacon up, and I like thick bacon. That's that. I'll see you in just a minute. Let's put this on here. This is even better. Yeah. That's even better. All right, guys, here we go. It's the final product. One for me. And uh, one for the boss. So she'll be here shortly. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead on and do our taste test. Because I want to taste this Chipotle seasoning. So. That's what it looks like on top. And all, give, all things give thanks to the Most High God who provides each and every meal for you those who have none. So, do a brief taste test. I'm going to cut you guys loose so I can finish my meal.
says it's great as a sandwich bread or for dipping. It tastes okay. I think I'm going to put some ketchup on mine, though, but that's that. I'm not going to sit here eating. Boy, y'all, thanks again for watching. Van Life, Black Pearl, PT Van Life, Benjamin living his best life. It's a beautiful day. Enjoy the rest of you guys this day and have a great day. Remember, um, Lead Farmer 77. Okay, his, his page, he has a lot of good pointers and tips about survival, survival skills, right? If you're interested, in, go ahead and want to check him out. And also, Van Man. Check out Van Man. He lives and works in his van full time. He's out on the West Coast. You know, go give him some support. He's new to He's new to, to YouTube, I guess. It's been a couple months, but guys, you need some support. Go check him out. And unto usual, guys, remember each and every one of you. You guys, you a star. You shine so bright. Live your very best life. Until our next video, guys. Shalom. I'll see you soon.